I've said it so many times, and it, it, it's just such a great rivalry. This game never disappoints you. Never disappoints you. Uh, we're really proud of this win. We beat a hot team. We beat a team with a lot of talent. Uh, Tommy's done a great job with that team. He's really got them playing well. They got a lot of weapons, uh, and they were all clicking. And we weren't. We weren't. We were a team that wasn't playing well. They were a team that was playing well. But we got, I think we got it back a little bit tonight. We got a, we're not back to exactly to where we were, but I think we got it back a little bit tonight. We got that feeling back. Tyrone said after the game, see, I'm tired again. So, you know, it was that feeling of how hard, how hard we have to play and how intense we have to be. And, and it, was, uh, it, it was a good feeling. It was a feeling we had to, to get us to 13-3. or three. So, uh, the league's ranked 12th now in the RPI, so, I mean, it seems the talent level is high. Is this between these two teams? Have you seen the talent level? Well, you know, people think, before. at the beginning of the year, people think that you just don't really want to make, you're just being, you're kind of being coy. They think you're being vague when you say that Siena's the best team and everybody else is the same. Now, now I think everybody can say, you know what, maybe, maybe that's the case. Because every team is good. Every team is good. I mean, every, right on down the line, two through ten, the rest of us, we're the same. We're the same. Siena's better than everybody else right now. Uh, but the rest of us, we're all the same. There's the, the, the margin, the, the difference is just, it's just so minute. I mean, it's, it's just, it's a great league. It's a great league. You look at that schedule, I don't know how many more we got. We, looked, we did it the other day, we looked at it and said, you know, there's no gimmies. There's no, there's no, like, there's no gimmies. So, um, um, yeah, it is a good league. And, and every game is good. You've got to bring it every night. Because if you don't, you know, you're, you're going to, we, we learned it. If you don't, you're going to lose that Marist. You're going to lose the Island at home. You're going to, you know, that, that's, that's why you got to do it. So we, we learn. We learn the hard way. And sometimes that's the only way you learn, by, by learning the hard way. But we've learned the hard way. You've got to bring it every night. Tom, can you talk about the fact that played out of the stretch, some of the shots he made? Oh, I thought he played great today. I mean, especially at the end when we needed him. Like, he came up big for us. I mean, it's funny because I told him before this game, like a couple of days, I said, how you go is how we go. I said, um, I'll play better than you play. Like, that's fine with myself. I mean, I need you to step up and be, be the big man that you are. And he, he did tonight, and he showed up and every day, every play. He showed up, and, you know, we needed a big basket. We went to him and scored every time. I feel the same way, Benson. I just feel when I'm, when I'm caught upon, I just got to give my all, you know. Coach has been talking it all week about, you got to play team defense, and, you know, and we responded and came out all out, you know. So it all starts with the defense, and everything's going to be plus. Did you did come out and you put the ball outside, and, you know, the field goal defense was ranked high. Were you determined to show that you had an inside game that could, could you know, get in trouble in the game? You can answer that, Tyrone. You gotta, I mean, oh, um, yeah. You would I think mean, we, they were one of the top defense, you know, and you guys really took it to them. Right. I mean, we wanted to, we wanted to throw the first punch today, and we did by going to our big fella, and and he delivered. You know, he delivered. You know, when we give him the ball, he delivers. And I mean, I'm just real proud of him that he's just playing so well right now, and I mean, he's just balling. And we just feel like can't nobody stop him down there when he get him on the block. You know, it was great to have a go-to guy, and it was just uh, on the bench. We just kept saying, "Let's get Benson the ball. Let's get Benson the ball. Let's get Benson the ball." And we just, you know, any kind of play we had or any kind of option we could run, it all ended up with, "Let's see if Benson's down there to get him the ball." I, I really think that, you know, they were harder in points too. And you, you can, you can look at the bruises on his body and his sore feet. And did you wear your flip flops? You should wear your flip flops. <laughs> his sore feet and all that stuff. I mean, he was scoring on a 300-pound guy. He was scoring on, I mean, good, tough, physical players. So it wasn't like, uh, you know, they didn't have a big guy to match up with them. I mean, they matched up pretty good. And Benson still was not going to be denied. Spot early in the game, first half, Tyrone hits a three, and the two of you kind of looked at each other, and both were kind of smiling and doing a little roof thing there. I know that we've talked about your shooting, but it, it, you know, a little better percentage tonight, kind of made this, some smart shots. I guess what was going on in both of your minds you know, well, I mean, Coach told me yesterday when I was working on it, just getting back. And then this morning, I came in around uh, 11 o'clock and did some more shooting and just, I mean, he, he always had confidence. Coach always had confidence in me. Like, he, he just told me, like, uh, I can't remember. We was watching the girls' game play. He just came to me and said, look, only you can get yourself out of it. I mean, I ain't going to tell you you got to do this. You need to do that. Don't listen to what everybody else saying. Just just blow up. Just do what you do. Especially you guys. Right. <laughs> and, <laughs> And that's what I did, you know. I talked to Coach Dobridge, and he's just like, maybe you need to do this just a little bit, jump a little bit more. That's what I did. And Coach Miles just like, you know what, forget that, man. Play defense. You, you, when you play D, then everything falls in place for you. And that's, you know, that's what I try to do today, try to work on that. Get the defense going first, and then maybe the offense will click for me.
Joe, what was going on? I mean, it was a little, you were emotional, but that was even a little extra. It was fun. I mean, it, it's just so much fun to coach this whole team. I mean, I've said, I've told them privately, and I said it publicly. This is one of the most, I mean, it's 31 years I've been coaching. It's one of the most fun teams I've ever been around. It was just fun to see Tyrone get the ball go through there. And he's, as, I, as I've said before, he lights up the room. He lights up the court. He lights up the arena. When he made a shot and started smiling. It, just, it was just, how could you not smile back? So it was, uh, it was fun. Is this the most athletic Fugis team you've seen in the time here? It is. I, I don't know if there's a more athletic team in the league. Uh, so, yeah, the short, the, answer, the short answer to that question would be yes, but take it a step further. I don't know if there's a more athletic team in the league. I mean, Frazier, I've told these guys, Watch some clip tapes. Watch some Canisius games. Every game you see, you'll see two highlight tape plays. You'll see two, a dunk by Frazier, a dunk by Vasquez Simmons. You'll see two highlight plays every game, and they did it again tonight. I mean, there's one, the tip dunk they had, and some other, you know. Tyrone, what you think of that tip dunk that Frazier had? <laughs> <laughs> that was a crazy tip. Like, I ain't seen nothing like that before. I mean, that was good. I mean, that top the one he had last year. I mean, he had yeah. one last year that was pretty good, and I thought, you know, it was great. But that one right there, I mean, <laughs> I don't know. That was, that was crazy, man. That was, I give him a 10 across the board for that. <laughs> the main thing, don't let it rattle you, right? Yeah, yeah I don't know one in that film. <laughs> <laughs> All right, last question. Okay. Go ahead. Coach, I think it was the second last bucket Benson had. It was a three-point play. You turned around and hugged Coach Martelli. Did he did he call that play, or was that just the reaction to the to the bucket? Uh, no, it was just a reaction to the yeah. bucket. No, not really. I mean, we, we all we all were just saying, let's just get it into him. Yeah. No. So. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys. <laughs>